Hey, hustlers, are you looking to do numbers like $10,000 a month selling on Amazon using the arbitrage business model? If that's you, one of the easiest and most reliable ways to do it is to get your replens up, your replenishable inventory. That's inventory that really, really helps you. And here's some of the reasons why it's reliable. You can count on these products. You can literally wash, rinse, and repeat. It helps you because it keeps inventory turning. It gets you your money back faster because it doesn't sit in your basement or wherever you're storing. It does not sit in the Amazon FBA warehouses. You don't want that. So that means you get your revenue back faster. People talk about scaling up. Well, replenishables is a great way to scale because if you got a good replenishable and you know how to keep it in stock, you're going to make money. You will not miss on opportunities. Now, let me show you what I'm talking about. I'm gonna give you an example of what I'm doing on Amazon myself. Okay, guys. So. Here we are. You can see today's date is April the 26th, the year is 2022. And we're inside of my seller central. That is the back office you get when you have a seller central account so that you could sell on Amazon. And as you can see so far today, I've had eight units sold. And if we look at my last 30 days, the running, I'm doing better than 10,000. I'm doing right now, $11,263.09. That's gross numbers, but that's okay. You guys are big, big, you guys are adults. You know how to figure it out. If you can get that type of inventory, then you can adjust and figure out how much you want to be able to keep based on your margins. We talk about that all the time. Guys, you got to understand something. A lot of people like to show screenshots. We ain't showing screenshots here. You're literally in my account. So understand that we're going to come down to reports in real time. We're going to come over to business reports in real time. This is not screenshots. This is real deal. OK, we're going to look at. Month to date. This is what we've done. This month. OK. That's just this month. But if we look, let's see, we could go year to date. This is how much we've done year to date. Now, if we take and divide that, we're we're 16 weeks in, guys, 16 weeks in. All, all we need to do is Google what is the current week. Today is Tuesday, so I'm not counting this as week 17, just so you know. But if this is what we've done so far this year, and we divide that by 16, this is what we're doing per week in gross sales, okay? But I'm doing it with replans. And what we're gonna do, we're actually, I'm gonna show you inside of my inventory lab so that you can see what percentage of my sales come from replans. This is very, very important for me to be talking to you about that. But the question you're gonna have and what I hear often is, how do I find replens? Guys, there is no, uh, <laughs> I mean, let's just face it. You're not gonna look at a product and on the label it says replen. The replens come from inside your mind, right? I mean, you gotta think. You guys are adults, you buy things all the time. Start with yourself. What are you constantly replenishing in your own home? Maybe you use toothpaste on a regular basis. And so that's a replant. Maybe you use mouthwash on a regular basis. Maybe you like to bathe. You use soap. These are things that people replant all the time. Things like uh, feminine napkins, uh, paper products such as napkins, paper plates, uh, even plastic flatware. Obviously, things like health and beauty, lotion, creams. Just think about it, hustlers. Uh, what about things like batteries? Those things people have to replace all the time. Here's the real, the, the, the real thing. A lot of times what happens, especially if you're a beginner, you don't really go in looking for replants. You go in 
selling what you can sell. In the beginning, you don't know what you want to work in, what you like, uh, what you seem to be particularly good at. Because what's going to happen is you're going to find a category. You're going to happen across, upon a category. And we don't know how that's going to happen, but it just does. And you find out, hey, I like this category. I excel in this category. I'm fast at processing. I can think through this particular category and then I can expand in this category. And oftentimes that may have replants. But I would say if you source, if you're a beginner and you source 10 new products, maybe one will turn out to be a reliable replant. So the key is not necessarily saying, hey, let me find some replants. The key is, the process is source products, especially if you're a beginner, source products. The replants will surface. The cream always rises to the top. Let's take a look inside of my uh, Amazon, well, my um, inventory lab account. Guys, this is why I just love the software inventory lab. We've got videos that teach you how to do it. There's just so much you can do that you cannot do to run your business in Seller Central. Remember, we just did a video where we talked about one of the keys that has helped has helped me is thinking like a manager. You need the right data in front of you in order to work things like a manager. Now, look, look at this column. All this is is under reports, category profitability. So you can't do that in Seller Central. But look at when you look at the different categories, you can see grocery is my number one. Now think about it, hustlers. Groceries. Is that a replenishable? Do people need it, consume it, and have to get more? Absolutely. Guys, if you're looking to for replants, grocery is, in my opinion, one of the number one categories. If you're looking to get ungated in that, it's not a big deal. There's a link in the description. If you want help with that, that's, that's no problem. But we're looking in the last month, okay? And I'm in 13 categories that, I, that I've that i been selling in in the last month. 396 units, and look at the amount, look at the percentage of revenue that's coming from grocery. That's because it's a replenishable. 76% of my sales, I've been able to build a business with the kind of numbers that you're looking at through replants, particularly in grocery, okay? Probably the next best would be automotive parts and accessories. Now, if you're not approved in that, that's okay, you'll get there. It took me a long time. I did not go to get ungated in automotive. I got auto ungated, but it probably took, oh my, oh my, over five years anyway. Then uh, health and beauty and arts and crafts. Think about that, guys. Health and beauty, that's a no-brainer. But a lot of times people aren't thinking about arts and crafts. Tell you what, we put together um, a replan help guide for you. A replan help guide. Just to give you some ideas, it's just a free PDF for you to download if you're a beginner and you kind of want to you know, have some thoughts in front of you. What categories should I be looking at? Again, I'm saying just source, just source. That's you learn by doing. But a lot of times, if you if you want a little bit of guidance, that push, you know, from you know somebody that might be a little bit further ahead than you, I'm that person. And on that note, if you'd like a little help, if you just want to ask a quick question for free, text the words "working class hustler" to the number on your screen. And, uh, and and you can text me once we get you onboarded. It's no big deal. I can help you out any way I can. That's what I do. That's what I'm here for. Take advantage of all of the resources. We talk about, if I'm telling you to source, well, how are you going to source? I do it with a software called Tactical Arbitrage. I've been using it for years and years. I've been teaching it for years and years. And why do I continue to invest in that software. It's simple, guys. It works.
Now we've got a complete mini series on it. We've got lightning courses on it, everything that you could possibly need to get you started. And if that ain't enough, just text me and we'll get you the help that you need. Guys, you can do it. Get excited. Okay. You can be doing five figures a month like me on the side, working a full-time job. Guys, I drive a tractor trailer. I'm on my way to work as soon as we finish this video. So I will see you guys in the next video.